this problem where I literally overthink the intro every single time and I've done it literally millions of times but for some reason every single time I sit down to film an intro I feel so awkward so this is gonna be my intro and today we're just gonna be doing another haul and I know you guys are probably sick of my hauls and you're like I need a lookbook of you styling these I promise I will have that soon it's just because I've been trying to build up my wardrobe which is why I put my outfits of the week on hold and all of that but today we're just gonna be doing a haul from Forever 21 Urban Outfitters and Zaffle and that is pretty much it I mean if you guys like my style or anything I do restyle on Depop and that's gonna be at Viola Demion and if you want to troll the internet with me or just be friends my Instagram is at Viola Demion and yeah let's just get right on into it We'll start with this shirt so this one is from urban outfitters i am seriously obsessed with it especially because if you guys don't know i used to have my hair like really bright blue and now like all these tones i feel like just look so much better with black hair and then i also it's like a matching set but it comes separately so it came with this skirt it is seriously adorable i feel like it is the most perfect outfit for the beach or something like that not even the beach but like if you go to dinner on the beach i mean when am i ever really gonna do that but i feel like this would be really cute with like a sun hat like a straw sun hat and a straw bag or something like that with a cute little white strappy heels we'll see if i'm even gonna wear these together i mean i don't do anything fancy but i thought that i needed that in my life and then i also got this cute little scrunchie i am obsessed with scrunchies i live for the half up half down and like having the scrunchie be really high so it like peeks through and this is like a cute little purple one again looks so much better with black hair now versus blue hair and i don't know i just thought it was really cute and then i also got these earrings so they're like more of a cheetah they're really thick let me see if i could like show you guys like is that not so cute for some reason it reminds me of the nanny i don't know why i haven't literally haven't watched that show since i was like five years old but i think they're really cute and chunky and would just look great with like no makeup but then just those earrings if you guys know what i'm talking about i feel like that's such a look and then since we are on like that cheetah hype i also picked up one of these dresses i am obsessed with the whole strappy straight collar if you guys saw my last thrift video that's like all of the dresses that I was thrifting and this is like the perfect midi dress and then the last thing that I got is just this dress to be honest in the try on portion it does not look that cute it's just this long um not long this oversized it reminds me of the road Mary Kate and Ashley's brand it's just really doesn't shape your body and I'm really into that look where it's just straight and kind of like your body your body silhouette disappears if anyone knows what i'm talking about i feel like i'm describing that really weird but if you guys know the row you'll know exactly what i'm talking about and it just gives that silhouette and again in the try portion i didn't iron it or anything so it looks really weird but i am like obsessed with it it's the perfect again little sundress for the beach or just anywhere tropical or just wearing around the house because why not that was everything that i got from urban outfitters now from forever 21 honestly they step up their game i feel like every time i go in there it's always a hit or miss but lately it's always been hits starting with this freaking crop top it is i am like obsessed with 70s colors lately and this is seriously like the cutest little top in the world it's amazing material like honestly it feels like something that it would sell at urban like i don't really see a quality difference i can tell that this is gonna last for a while and then i also got this tank which surprised is very thick something that I've noticed with forever 21 like tank tops like this is that it's very thin but for some reason this one is really thick and it came cropped which is cute and it says cherry lips on it I am literally apes obsessed with cherries I think they are like the cutest thing in the world so I decided to pick this top up and then I picked this up this honestly just straight reminds me of Sydney Carlson that's why I picked it up I was like I am obsessed with this it just gave me such early 2000s vibe and I actually just paired it with a cute little denim mini skirt and I did like that whole Christina Aguilera hair and it was just such a look and I am obsessed with this shirt these little cherry earrings I also did get from forever 21 they are literally the most perfect thing I posted a picture with them and so many of you guys were asking where i got these from i got them from forever 21 i'm like obsessed with them i feel like forever 21 is really good with jewelry the majority of my jewelry is actually from forever 21 which is surprising i just like it i mean it's cheap it's like five dollars and it lasts me a really long time but that's besides the point what am i doing oh yeah 
we're gonna go on to bottoms starting with these cute little like flared out plaid I really like how it had the frill it reminds me of this blogger Victoria she's known as in the fro and I'm just really into the more expensive designer looks like Chanel and all of that but I can't afford it so it's really nice when I can find something that kind of looks like that for really cheap and then I also got another like off stitching I'm like obsessed with this I am in love with the whole it's not necessarily thick stitching but off stitching and I don't have a black denim skirt so I thought this was perfect and again it's like really thick and nice material I actually bought jeans which is really weird because I don't remember the last time I bought jeans actually I can tell you the last time I bought jeans I'm not even kidding I think it was like four years ago maybe five years ago I do not buy jeans sometimes I will thrift them that's the only time but I actually went out and hunted for jeans and only because of the bottom do you guys see this I couldn't even believe that they were forever 21 or let alone even fit me these were $28 which is like not honestly not that bad for like the amazing quality that it is it's a little bit too big at the top for me I wish it like cinched in but that I always have that problem with jeans and I don't know even though it's summer I don't care these are like the most perfect freaking jeans and the way they f like fray out I don't know I thought it was like the cutest thing ever and then I also did pick up these little I don't know what you would call them like sweats kind of flare out they would go really good with that stripe uh, shirt that I showed you guys in the beginning and they flare out at the bottom they're kind of sweats but they're just enough to where you can wear them outside and I was surprised that they fit me really well because usually it's like stuff like this looks weird on me because I am so short and I feel like only really tall people look at in this but for some reason the way this was made it just looked cute and that was pretty much it so now we're gonna move on to Zaffle so again this is not sponsored nothing like that but they did send me all of this stuff for free again just so I can review it to you guys and I feel like every single time I have to mention this when I do pick out stuff from Zaffle they do send me to like a pop page where I have to pick certain things out so it's not like I go on the website and pick whatever they want so I feel like a lot of this stuff is like better material than a lot of their other things because I have in the past just went on the website like in the beginning and picked out whatever I wanted but this time they like changed it up I don't know why they did that but I did get a lot of cute things starting with the bathing suits if it's anything that I do have to say it's that the bathing suits on Zaffle every single time I've ordered them I have never had a problem it's always been good material but I have watched other people's bathing suit stuff where it's been like misses so I feel like it might be because I'm always choosing from the popular page but again I don't really know I just thought I would mention that so starting with this literally amazing freaking like do you guys see this what is this it's not snake skin rattle skin crap I forgot what it's called but I'm like obsessed with this pattern and then it came with a matching bandeau top I am it's something about the bandeau and bottoms of Zaffle like I just love their bathing suits a lot of the times I can't find any bathing suits but for some reason theirs is like literally the best and it comes with a choker the only thing with this is that on the website it says it's a size 4 for a medium and in the past I have always ordered a small which is still a size 4 but for this bathing suit their medium was a 4 and it fit bigger so I feel like I could have gone a size smaller so it could fit me a little bit more tightly but still it fits and I have no complaints but this bathing suit is a small and I feel like I definitely should have got a medium because this top I mean it fits me but it is a little bit too booby but I'm not complaining I mean it fits me the only thing is is the bottoms I do not have a try on portion for you guys because it is way too small on me but this is what the bottom looks like and this is a small again it says a size 4 but it definitely does not fit like a size 4 and it I don't know it's really cute and I'm upset that it doesn't the bottoms don't fit me because it seriously is the most adorable thing in the world and then yeah those are the only bathing suits that I got because I got like a, a lot of the other bathing suits from previous hauls so I had to kind of start branching out starting with this top seriously I am so freaking in love with it it looks really small but then it stretches out and I think it's 
I mean, it's like okay. I feel like I would call this more like Forever 21 material and it kind of looks weird like right here on the neckline, but I don't mind it. I think it still looks cute on. I have worn this a couple times already. And then this shirt right here, okay, this I'm literally obsessed with. I wore this actually in my last video. I think this is freaking adorable. The only complaint that I had with this is in the picture, it just looked like a little bit more muted of a yellow versus in person it's like a really bright yellow so it kind of in a way makes it look a little bit more cheap but i don't care because literally it is so adorable i wish i could have this shirt in like a million different colors because i love the way that this fits and the last shirt that i got is just another again i told you i'm obsessed with this print is just this bandeau top and it's like kind of like a shirt the material is really thin to be honest but it's like really soft it doesn't feel cheap it's just very thin if that makes sense so i don't know i think it's cute if you have really big boobs you would definitely have to wear like a strapless bra with this i might even wear a strapless bra with this just because it is so thin but i don't know i like it i i would still gonna wear this i'm not gonna throw it away or anything like that now definitely for the miss of like the entire freaking haul is this set i knew it was gonna be bad and i still ordered it it is just i'm just gonna be honest it's not that it's poorly made or crappy material it's just like a really lower forever 21 quality is the best way i can describe it also i'm sorry forever 21 that i keep like bagging but that's the best way that i can describe it. or maybe like a charlotte russe or like wet seal wet seal is probably a better description it's just like it's not necessarily that it's see-through but this would probably be super cute these bottoms for someone first off that is way smaller than me because i got a small and these were way too small like they did not look cute on me but i feel like these would be really cute like bathing suit bottoms like if you're on the beach and you're wearing a bathing suit and then this over it because it is see-through it would be really cute but the top is just it fits weird like i can't describe it i mean you'll see it's just there's a lot going on at the top and it just it wasn't exactly how I pictured it would be. I'm not gonna throw away or like donate this top because I actually do like it. It's just like these flowers, they're kind of weird. I'm gonna tr might try to like iron them or something. And I mean, you can't really, you can't see my nipples through these, so it's great. So actually the top isn't see-through, it's just the bottoms. So I am gonna get rid of the bottoms, but they, I mean, they are cute. There's just definitely not what I was expecting and it's way too small, but like the top is way too big, if that makes sense. And then the last set that I got is just this gingham. It is, oh my gosh, so adorable. I am obsessed with it. It reminds me of like a guest mom for some reason and then the bottom is just like this long skirt and it buttons all the way up it does fit like a little bit tight but i feel like i could do with it because it is so freaking cute and yeah that is pretty much it for this entire haul i feel like i went through that really fast because i just suck at describing things and i want to get through everything so it's not like an entirely freaking long video but yeah thank you guys so much for watching please like subscribe do all of that and i will see you guys in my next video